Hello, I'm Mario Cordo, this fish in the fishing trap. Hello, good morning. Welcome to Mario Lassen Channel. So, today's video ay mangisda po tayo ngayon. Pero doon po tayo mangisda, doon po sa open area sa dagat para maiba naman po maghunting po tayo ng isda. Meron po tayo ditong bungsod, pero I decide na mag-sit up po ng fishing trap doon po sa malalim sa dagat. So ito pala ang fishing trap na gagamitin po natin. Mangisda doon sa dagat. So meron po tayong apat po na fishing trap. Fishing trap na ito, pag makapasok yung isda, dito yan sila papasok. Sila papasok, ganyan. Tapos, very wide ang entrance nito. Pero dito, napakaliit. So pag gusto nilang lumabas, hindi na sila makalabas. Ang fishing trap na ito ay kailangan po natin isit doon sa dagat. At least mga 2 to 3 days natin doon ilagay. Para talaga na mapasukan tayo ng isda. And of course, kailangan po natin lagyan ng pain. Po yung gagamitin nating pain. Ayan. Can you smell it? Yes, yeah, strong. <laughs> Very strong. Yan ang magpapa-attract sa ano, sa isda. Papasok yan sila. So, the fish will attract honey. Would you like me to cut it for you, honey bee? Do you know how to cut? Yeah. There we go. Try. <laughs> Pang paswerte. Maybe we can cut lots of fish now, honey, because you're your dollar. I'm what? You're a dollar. <laughs> Joke. Dito po natin to ilalagay yung fishing trap. Give me the other one, honey. Did you stay in the boat? Yeah. Good luck. Can you give me one fish trap? Yeah. Good luck. Hope you catch lots of fish. Thank you. Kunin ko po yung pain. I already set the fish trap in the coral reefs. Oh really? Yeah. That's There good. Go. Thanks. Yeah, here's another one.
here again. So guys, mga dalawang araw na po natin na sit yung fishing trap. Ngayon guys ay babalikan po natin yung fishing trap na sinit up po natin. Sana nga po, sana nga po maraming pumasok na isda. So let's find out and good luck. Balikan lang po natin kung saan po natin nilagay yung fishing trap natin. guys, here we go again. Babalikan po natin yung sinit po nating fish trap. <laughs> Wow! Ayan guys. Naku. Mga ano to ata pumasok sa atin. Mga dollar fish. <laughs> Kaso, yung dalawa, patay na ata. Yung iba buhay pa. Huh. Ayan. Buhay pa po tong, ano yung ipang isda. Wala ka. Napakamahal pa naman itong ano. Itong malalaki oh. Sayang. Mga 2 to 3 days na kasi natin to ano eh, minalikan. Kaya yung iba, patay na. Ayan. Sayang po.
naman. Mga coral fish. Oh my god. Yan guys. <laughs> Napasukan din po tayo sa pangalawang ano natin, fishing trap. Ito oh, buhay pa yung isa. Ito yung mamahalin isda. Wow. Uh, get it. That's really good. You got heaps. <laughs> this is a coral fish. Coral expensive trout. Expensive one. Lapu lapu. And there is very, very expensive. Really? But it's already dead. There they are. They've got spots. Uh, there's more. Put it down there. Put it down in the boat. Wow, well, Mario caught all these fish in the fishing trap. So many. More. More fishy fishy. More fishes. Another one. Four of them. Oh. These are big, the reddish colored ones. So guys, I'm very happy. Kasi bawat fishing trap na nilagay po natin ay may laman po. Mga buhay po po talaga. Ito o. Oh. Very spiky fish. Mga isda sa bato po yan. Have a look this one, honey. Yeah, a nice one. Nice color. Oh my God, sayang po. <laughs> Pira na, naging bato pa. Mamahaling po ito na isda. Ay, ay, ay. Woo! Guys, kung alam nyo lang kung magkano ang kilo na ito, napakamahal ito bilhin sa Siargao. Tignan nyo guys, oh, it was too late. It was too late when I arrived, honey. It's yeah. already dead. <laughs> really? Maybe if we come a bit earlier, probably buhay pa po siya. Pero ang klaseng isda na to ay super sensitive. Hindi po to ayaw niya po sa ano, mal maliit na space. So itong lapu-lapo, matibay yan. Matibay yan ang sigmura. Tingnan nyo guys, so buhay pa. Ito, if I'm not wrong, hindi pa to nag, nag half an hour, namatay siya. Bago lang po talaga namatay, oh, yung hasang pulang pula pa. Sayang po. Yung laki. Tusok na yung mata. Wow. Whew, wow. That's the first trap. First fish trap. Ayan guys. Lagyan po natin ng dagat. Kasi sila po lapo buhay pa. Yung ibang isda buhay pa. When I jump, pa yung iba buhay pa po talaga. There's the giant mouth monster, bloody monster mouth. Big. Whew. Got two. More here, dami dito. Oh. 
classy-classy po talaga. This is the humble boss. <laughs> Tingnan niyo guys. Ang cute. Napakaliit. Oops. Ayaw niyang lumabas. This is the last one. Grabe guys. Ang hirap pa labasin. Pag natatrap yung isda, hindi na talaga makalabas. Finally, put them all in the back, honey. So, ayan guys. Upo yung nakuha natin sa apat po na fishing trap na nilagay po natin sa may bato. So, pero po ditong malalaki. Kaso guys, it was too late talaga. Nung pagbalik natin dito, patay na sila. Ayan, oh. Mga red pa talaga yung hasang nila. Press na press pa to. Ito yung lapu-lapu. Mga buhay pa po. Matagal po sila mapatay. Dior, nag-aaway sila sa ilalim. Kasi maliit lang yung ano natin. Fishing trap. Natin to, ano, hindi natin ito mabibinta ng mga ano, buhay talaga. Dahil ang dami niya pong damage. Ayan o. Oh. Siguro dahil sa ano, sa fishing trap, maliit yung space. Nag ano sila, nag-scratch each other. Ayan o. Oh. Marami na yung damage. So rin. So, siguro ano lang, kakainin lang namin to. <laughs> Grabe, ang daming kakainin. Mga first class honey. Where's your first class of fish? Thank you. That's a very good fish. It's a trout fish. Yeah, it's very nice. Look at that, the color. Yan. That one behind you. I guess it's so nice guys na may pumasok po sa aming fishing trap. At least po guys, makakalibre naman po kami ng ulam. Although mayroon po kaming bungsod, it's nice to explore and adventure. Ano pong klaseng isda ang makukuha natin kung itry po natin manguha sa open area. And that's all for today's video. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much, much for watching our video. video. Please like and subscribe our channel. Bye!